Creating recurring tasks inside of monday.com is gonna make sure you do not forget the really important things you need to do on a weekly, daily, or monthly basis. And I'm gonna show you how to set that up inside of monday.com. As you can see here, I am in an example monday.com system on an example to-do list. Now, I'm gonna get straight to the point. How do, we re how do we create recurring tasks? It's super simple. Just go to the automate button in the top right-hand corner here. And then we wanna to go to board automations in the middle, go to our automation on the far right hand side, and then we are looking for this trigger. So select the when this happens. The trigger we are looking for is every time period. This is going to be our trigger. Go ahead and select this option, and then we need to just define the settings. So we've got three options here, daily, weekly, or monthly. So if we'd like the recurring task to occur every day, and then we need to select the one day at every two days at every three days at so the amount of time between and then we need and then we need to select the time that this automation is going to run so 7 40 7 a.m is the earliest which is a bit aggressive so i've maybe moved this to 9 a.m so every three days at 9 a.m and then we need to go ahead and create our action but going back onto this a second we have got weekly as well so we can go ahead and select the weekly option so we can say every monday every two weeks on a Monday at, every three weeks on a Monday at or a Thursday, and then we select the time. So as you can see here, every week on Monday and Thursday at 7.45, I can unselect one day and then maybe change this to two weeks. So every two weeks on Thursday at 7.45 a.m. And again, we can apply this to monthly. So you can see here exactly the same principle applies. So every month on the 15th at 7.45 a.m. or every three months at 7.45 a.m. to so Jan, April, July, and October. This is really clever. This is gonna make sure that whatever you are managing, you are not going to forget. So I'm gonna go to the daily every three days at 9 a.m. And then from the trigger, we have our action. So we've got notify, create group, duplicate group, or create item. I would imagine in most instances, it's going to be create item. So go ahead and select this option. And then we just need to define what is on that item. So it's really, really simple. Firstly, select the group that you would like the item to go to. So I've got three groups here. I've got to do, doing and done. As this is a task list, it would just go straight to the to do. Then we need to give our item a name. So I'll just call this example item for the sake of the video. And then we've got the person. So who is being assigned to this recurring task? Now, of course, you have to define it as one person. So I'm going to go ahead and select myself. And then we need to predefine the status as well. So it's going to be to do. And then I would leave the date column. Unfortunately, the date column can't be automatically populated that is a limitation inside of monday.com at the moment which is quite frustrating i'd imagine on your board you may have many different column options or various column options so just work through everything and make sure everything has been properly entered in as this is your recurring task so once you're happy go ahead and press create automation and congratulations you have created recurring tasks inside of monday.com so every three days that item is going to be created now for whatever reason if you need to change this maybe the person you're assigning it to changes or you need to change the frequency it's super super easy just go back to the automation and go to the three dotted button on the far right hand side and press edit automation and you can change this however you like. So if you need it to be weekly or you need to change what's written on the item or who it's assigned to or the status or the group or anything else, this is the place to do it. Just press update automation and the changes that you've made will be updated automatically. Hopefully this video has been helpful, showing you how to use recurring tasks inside of monday.com. If you need any help setting up monday.com for your business, check out the link below. We'd be delighted to help. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you soon. Goodbye.